Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the channel. I am Starco Gaming and we are back with another Marvel Future Fight video. By the way guys, make sure you follow us on Twitch. Link in the description that down below. We stream every Saturday night, uh, 9 p.m. Eastern time and we do have crystal coupon giveaway in every stream. So make sure you join us guys. So guys, today, in today's video, we're going to be clearing Mephisto Stage 19 for the first time finally guys been getting uh mephisto's wall boss of the day uh for like three times in the past week so allow us to actually do some progression on this one so uh first guys we're gonna go through the teams we're gonna be using obviously and then we're gonna be jumping into the gameplay so we jump in the team we're gonna be using this is a team pretty basic pretty simple we need to use three male characters guys so we're gonna have cyclops leads which bring 35 percent increase of all basic attack to all eyes and also has a tier one passive of 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 what uh 30 percent energy attack so that give us 65 percent increase attack to uh mephisto obviously we're gonna have mephisto also we're gonna have taskmaster taskmaster with his uniform uh actually brings a uh, 40 percent increase damage dealt to super villain faction so and that give us a lot of extra damage obviously so this is the thing we're going to be using now let's take a look at the build on my mephisto and then let's jump into the gameplay right after that so first uh the rank is 5050 not the best rank but still pretty decent rank stats guys we have max cooldown maxing our defense we only have 176.25% critical damage. It's going up slowly, but we're not up there yet, guys. Still leveling the new alliance. Uh, by the way, guys, if you score over 50 million and uh, want to join the Starco squad, we're currently level 18 and uh, progressing pretty fast. And soon enough, we are going to be able to uh, pierce the top 100, top 30, and then eventually top 16. Uh, after that, we have critical rate at 75%. Energy attack is 74,860 uh, with the lead we do have right now. If we look at the gear, guys, we have uh, a few blessings. We have 2, 4, 6, um, 7, 8 nine blessings guys on this guy it's not the best yet but at least we got a bunch of blessing on this dude and uh, we're getting close to remove some cooldown right yes uh next uh next level the alliance hits we're going to be able to remove uh one cooldown hero so we're going to be able to get that critical damage up to 180 percent at least that's going to be pretty awesome but yes we have nine blessings guys on this dude uh if we go with the enhancement type that's going to matter but still that's rank four easel set we have fully awakened overdrive easel set uh so we get 8.5 percent all attack all defense critical rate critical damage 8.1 percent no defense with the 40 percent damage proc artifact in fact we have a pure evil artifact guys so uh, more damage against wall boss uh obviously custom gear we have a mighty ctp at judgment not the best one out there guys but still a pretty decent one 16 percent increase all basic attack and defense all basic attack increased by 22 percent that's the part that it's not that great as you can see you can go up to 32 percent but we have 19.9 percent .9 chain of damage this is a big reason why we kept this one eventually we're going to re-roll it but um not anytime soon guys i have to save like 200 custom gear uh boost for that and that'll take a very very long time uh we have a uh, 30 percent uh all resistance downs does not ignore immunity anyway it's wall boss legends does not really matter and then we have 200 percent proc on this one this guy has no uniform so we don't have to go through uniform now the skills that we're going to be using the skills is going to be pretty simple guys we're going to use the third skill uh, at the start of fight and never going to use it again unless we have to switch characters so we can actually get the increased damage against super villain uh faction by what 15 percent when we use that skill you know yeah here increase 30 percent so increase basic damage dealt to super villain faction by 30 percent so we're going to use that one time and if we need to switch to run away or something like that we're going to use it again the win we switch back to mephisto then after that the rotation is going to be pretty simple it's going to be two daily cancel one cancel five cancel four and uh, when the awakening skill not the awakening skill but the tier three skills is ready pretty much is going to be two delicates so one cancel five cancel six cancel four 
and that's pretty much going to be the rotation basically you want to trigger uh, the proc at the end of the second skills and then chain with the fifth skill with the proc already activate which does not always work the way you want but that's pretty much the rotation guys the rotation is the same as the abx rotation it's pretty simple just gonna not gonna get kicked out of your uh, rotation and you going to be fine and that's pretty much all guys for uh you know the talking portion of this video because next we'll be jumping into the gameplay section if you guys have any question comment feedback let me know in the comment section guys uh thank you for watching thank you for being part of my amazing community you all enjoy the gameplay section and i'll see you guys again in the next video thank you